It's cold outside, which means that action on the basketball court is sizzling hot. Steph Curry of the Golden State Warriors has finally gone past Trey Allen to become the all-time three-point leader in league history, while his team and the Phoenix Suns are pacing the NBA in wins. Meanwhile, the Brooklyn Nets are fighting with the Chicago Bulls and the Milwaukee Bucks for the top spot in the Eastern Conference. While the action on the court has been exciting, the drama off the court has only intensified due to the most recent COVID-19 surge. The Brooklyn Nets have had their last three games postponed as a number of players and due to the league's health and safety protocols, including stars Kevin Durant and Kyrie Irving, Harden has since been cleared to return. But Brooklyn is far from the only Christmas Day team impacted by the pandemic. The Bucks, Hawks, Celtics, Lakers, Knicks and Warriors have all had major players go on the health and safety protocols list recently, with the Mavs on Wednesday announcing that star Luka Doncic is the latest big name to go down. Even with some major stars out, the league has gone ahead with its highly anticipated slate of Christmas Day games. Here's the remaining schedule, with all games airing nationally on ABC and ESPN. Golden State Warriors vs Phoenix Suns, 5 p.m. ET, 2 p.m. PT, on ABC Brooklyn Nets vs Los Angeles Lakers, 8 p.m. ET, 5 p.m. PT, on ABC and ESPN Dallas Mavericks vs Utah Jazz, 10.30 p.m. ET, 7.30 p.m. PT, on ESPN Although this is a lineup for Christmas Day, NBA fans looking to follow the drama and stream their team's games throughout the rest of the season will need access to a few channels to catch every second of the season. ABC and ESPN will combine to televise 101 games, TNT will air 65 and NBA TV will have 107. All out-of-market games will continue to air on NBA League Pass, which is a great choice if you follow a team in a different city from where you live. Local fans won't be able to able to watch their team play on League Pass, as broadcasts of local games air exclusively on regional sports networks. While you absolutely don't need cable to watch basketball this year, it still might be the easiest and cheapest choice depending on where you live.